Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set from uh, CAD 2018, slot 1 DILR says that a company conducts a written test comprising of three sections of 20 marks each, data interpretation, written English and general awareness. A composite score out of 80 is calculated. There is a composite score that is done by doubling the marks in DI. So in DI, the score is doubled and the other two are added as they are. The candidates who score less than 70% marks in two or more sections are disqualified. So it means in order to qualify, one must score more than or equal to 70% in two or three subjects. From among the rest, the four with the highest composite score are recruited. So if a person qualifies, they are recruiting only four. If four or fewer candidates qualify, all who qualify are recruited. Ten candidates appear for the written test. Their marks in the test are given below. Some of the data is missing in this table and we are given some more conditions. Based on it, we need to fill in the information to the maximum possible and answer the questions. So uh, first thing first is uh, we need to calculate the composite score. Okay, and uh, that is calculated by multiplying di by 2 and adding this. So let's fill the composite score for the people for whom we know the all three scores. So Chetna, it is 38 plus 1250 plus 454. Okay. Then we have Esther, it is 24 plus 3458. Then next we have is uh, Falak, 30 plus uh, 17, that is 47. Okay, so these three scores we can fill, the rest we cannot. For that, we will need the information given in the statements over here. First says, no two candidates had the same composite score. So this composite score is unique for all people. Ajay was the unique highest scorer in WE. Now in WE, we, need, we know some person has scored 18. So Ajay has to score greater than 18 in this. And it should be unique. Unique means either it will be 19 or it will be 20, but no other person will have that score. Okay, so Ajay can score 19 or 20 marks in this. Among the four recruited, Geeta had the lowest composite score. So among the four recruited, so Geeta has should have the fourth. He should Geeta should be fourth in the recruitment list. Okay, we'll use that later. Indu was recruited. She is recruited. Danish. Harini and Indu scored the same marks in GA. So let us say they scored X marks in GA. The last condition says Indu and Jatin both scored 100% in exactly one section. And Jatin's composite score was 10 more than Indu's. So Jatin can score 100% only here. If he scores 100% here, his total score is 70. Okay. Now Indu was recruited. So Jatin has more score than him. Uh, then Hindu and all scores are more than 14. So Jatin is also recruited. Okay. Next thing comes here is uh, in which subject will Hindu score 100%. It says Hindu scored 100% in exactly one section. So she cannot score 100% in both. So if she scores 100% here, let's just imagine she scores 100% here. So 40 plus 8 and her total is 60. It is saying that Jatin's composite score is 10 more than Hindu's. So 48 then it should be 12 but in order to qualify it is given that Indu was recruited so she should have at least 14 marks in two sections this case is not possible so that means Indu has 20 marks in this section and the value of x is 20 and if she has 20 marks here 28 she need to make 32 more that means 16 marks in di now we can fill data for some more people because we have already got this information okay now uh, if we start with harini we cannot fill her marks geeta we need to fill uh, let's put danish danish all the values are known to us so this is 35 plus this is 16 more that is 51 okay now ajay is 16 plus it could be 39 or 40 16 plus 39 or 40 that means the total will be 55 or 56. Sorry, 35 or 36. 16 plus 19 is 35, 35 or 36. So that means 
Ajay's total will be 51 or 52. Now, Danish has a total of 51. So, it cannot be 51. That means Ajay should have a total of 52. Now, Ajay's total is 52. That means Ajay got 20 marks in WE. So, this is also done. Now, the only thing that we need to figure out is uh, Gita because Gita is given fourth and for rest of the people, we are not given any information here. Okay. Bala, no information is given. Harini, no information is given. So, we need to find Gita. Now, Gita has the fourth highest score. Okay. And uh, we do not know whether uh, like uh, others are recruited or not. That will depend. Gita has to have, have the fourth highest. So, Jatin is in, uh, recruited. 70 score. Hindu is recruited. If we see Esther, Esther is also recruited because Esther has uh, 18 and 16 in two of the subjects. Now, if you look at the next number, that is uh, Chetna. Chetna has 54. Chetna is not recruited. So, Gita can have less than Chetna also. Now, let us do one thing. Let us try to put the maximum possible score that she can get and then we will see the conditions and figure it out. So, Gita has 28 here plus 6. So, she has 34 till uh, uh, DI and GA. So, 34 marks are done. Now, we need to see that can she get a 20 here. So, if she gets 20 here, is it possible? No, because it is saying that Ajay was the unique highest scorer in WE. So, point 2 makes it false. So, we cannot have 20 here. Now, can she have 19? If she has 19 here, her total will be 53, possible, okay. If we put 19, 53 is possible. What if we put 18, that would make it 52, okay. That is not possible because Ajay has a total of 52. If we make 17, she will get 51, okay, 51 already Danish has a score of 51. If we make 16, she will get 50. Now, suppose if you make 50, let's just imagine that she makes a score of 50. Will she be fourth in the list? So, Indu, Jatin and Esther are already above her. Okay. And if you see, Danish has also has more than 50. Right. So, Danish would have been recruited instead. Or uh, even Ajay would be recruited. Right. Ahead of Gita. So, Gita can have only 53 as the possible score. So, she got 19 marks in WE and a total of 53. So, this is the score line that we can fill for rest there will be condition based questions okay so these are the scores of the people so we were able to fill these uh, three four five six seven six missing values okay seven in fact which of the following statements must be true jatin's composite score was more than that of danish that is true indu scored less than chetna in di indu scored 16 in di and chetna scored 19 in di right so it is true now, this one could have guessed also uh, by looking at the uh, information that Jatin has high score. So, obviously, without even solving the complete set, one could answer because Jatin score 100% in this, right? So, Jatin would be more than Danish. Indu cannot, Chetna has very high score, very less chance that Indu could get 20 here. Okay. So, that is also true. Okay. And Jatin scored more than Indu in GA. Now, for that, you need to solve. So, Jatin scored less than Indu. So, first and second are true. So, both 1 and 2 are true. Next question, which of the following statements must be false? So, I have complied the data into the table over here. Which of the following must be false? Uh, Harini's composite score was less than that of Falak. Okay, Harini less than Falak. Okay. Is, it, is it necessarily false? Let's see. Uh, if Harini puts 10 here, that is 30. Uh, she can have 19. Okay, Harini's score is less than that of Falak. She cannot have 20, but she can have 19, right? So she can have 49. So that is not necessarily false. Chetna scored more than Bala in DI. Chetna scored 19 in DI, and Bala uh, can be can Bala score more than Chetna in DI? So if Bala scores 20 here, what happens? Right? Bala will not be recruited. That is perfectly fine. And if Bala scores 20, the score will be and the score will be uh, 60, right? So that is not possible. So Bala cannot score uh, more than, uh, if Bala scores 19 here, so the total will be 38. Bala's score will be 58 and Esther is scoring 58. So Bala cannot score 19 also. 
so chetana has scored more than bala in di so this is also true this may be true may be false not necessarily false bala scored same as jatin in di now we saw that bala cannot score 20 or 19 so that means this is also uh, this is a false statement bala scored same as jatin in di that is false okay so others could be true or maybe true false but not definite not necessarily false Bala's composite score was less than that of Esther. Esther has 58. So, Bala will definitely get less than 58. See, most of the statements are related to Bala. So, Bala cannot get 20 here. That will make 60. Okay. Bala gets 19. That will make 58. So, that is, these two conditions are not possible. So, Bala gets less than 19. And if Bala scores less than 19, his composite score is less than 58. So, that means this is uh, true. This is also true. Harini and Falak, we can't say because uh, Harini's score can be less or can be more. Okay, It can be both. Harini's score can be less also than Falak. So, if let's say 30, if he has, if she has a lower score, let's say uh, 15, right? So, she could have had a score of 45 also. So, we can't say this one, but this is definitely false statement. So, we will choose option C. If all the candidates except Ajay and Danish had different marks in DI. Okay, so uh, Ajay and Danish do not have the same marks in DI. They have the same marks in DI and rest have other different marks. Bala's composite score was less than Chetna's composite score. So Chetna's composite score is 54. So Bala is less than 54. Okay, that we need to uh, uh, take. What is the maximum marks that Bala could have scored in DI? Okay, so uh, we have bala like it is less than 54 right so if you put 54 let's try to put 54 then the maximum marks could be 20 plus 34 right that make 54 so that means bala should get less than 70 okay less than 17 because it is total is less than 54 so less than 17 uh, we have 16 which is not possible 15 which is not possible 14 which is not possible so bala can have 13 so, is it possible to score 13 also? Let us check. If it is 13, 26 plus 20, that will be 46. So, that is possible. So, maximum Bala can score is 13 marks. If all the candidates score different marks in WE, then what is the maximum marks that Harini could have scored in WE? So, all score distinct marks in WE. Right, so uh, 20 is not possible, 19, 18, uh, 17 is 17 possible, let's check. If she gets a 17 here, so that means the score will be 27 plus 20, 47. But Falak already had 47, so she cannot get 17. Next, uh, 16 is not possible, 15 is not possible. Can she get 14 now? If she gets 14, then we have 24 plus 20, that is 44, which is possible. So, maximum she can score is 14 in WE. So, this was the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.